this is a big event for me. Uh, over the years, I've been asked to speak about Sunil, but uh, I felt that those who played international cricket with him, like Ravi or the others, are the right people to tell you about what his class and caliber was when he played for India. The bravest batsman to ever play cricket, the toughest guy to ever face fast bowling, and technically fantastic. But I must tell you that as we grew, as we grew along, I've written lots of notes, but I don't know whether what I'll just it just comes out of me and I'll say it. As we grew along, I must make a commitment over here that Sunil Gavaskar was not half as good as Sachin Tendulkar. I must tell you all this. He was not half as good as Sachin Tendulkar. In our days of cricket, when we played, the most talented youngster amongst us has got to be none other than Eknath Solkar. He was our captain at India schools, and he was the one that we tried to emulate. All of you must be firmly believing in destiny, and Skavaskar is the child of destiny. <laughs> Many must be aware over here that uh, when he was born, he had a little hole in his ear. And he, the cradles were changed. And Gavaskar perhaps would have been a Sunil Tigdi or a Sunil Kohli, still scoring the runs. But his uncle saw him and then put him in the right cradle and brought him home. He and I lived in an environment of, uh, in a compound which had four buildings called Bhagirathi building. Though his mother made Chikhalwadi a very famous uh, locality, we were not from Chikhalwadi, the Hazares and the Ambias were. And we felt a bit, uh, you know, derogatory that uh, we lived in the Chikhalwadi, but we didn't. Why is it that uh, Sunil and I came together? I don't know. My parents were much older than him. They were not friends because in that compound of 24 buildings, everybody were friends. You know, in the earlier years of a joint family tradition, everybody came from the same middle class background. All, all those friends over there, the Ashok Ambes and the Papya Mandrekars and the Kishore Ambes and all those who lived there, Padya Mandrekars. And uh, there was a guy called uh, Pradeep uh, Dilip Pandrekar, who he named Peter Tuhi. He, they look same like him. And he sent a photograph of uh, Tuhis and Pupya Mandrekars together in, to show us how the similarity was. Such was Sunil that he remembered his childhood friends every now and then. But coming back to the point I made earlier, I don't know why we came together, honestly. There were all those kids going to DGT and Maratha and Robert Money and... Um, Chikitsak, all those vernacular schools in that area. But Sunil's mother one day came to my house and uh, said that Sunil and Milin will go to the same school. And that's how we landed in St. Xavier's High School. We were lucky because uh, it has stood us in good stead now that we went to a very fine school.